，叮当，叮叮当，叮叮当，叮叮当，叮当，叮叮当，叮当。You can't sing Chinese. That's the one thing you can't say. That's my that's my Star Wars guy's name. What? Ching Chong. I mean, okay. Quick question. I don't know if we'll play it on here because it'll take. Actually, we definitely will at some point. I'm sure we will. But. One of the greatest games ever created. Kotor. Knights of the Old Republic. Oh, oh yeah. my fucking god. I've never god. played it. Oh, that's that's the most putrid, disgusting, fucked up, flabbergasting bullshit thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Sorry? So, uh, we were talking about an improv game. What is this? That's a uh, power up. No! I could have used this! Dumbass. How do I do this every fucking day? I don't know. Every single fucking episode. <laughs> so, Ash. Yes? <laughs> uh, the reverse interview. Kay. One of us plays reporter. One Wait, of us maybe we could do that fight again. No, there's a checkpoint. Fuck! <laughs> one of us plays the interviewee. Okay. And we basically start in reverse. So, like, the interviewee or the reporter will be like, do the sign off. And we'll just go. You talk regularly, I guess. But the points of topic go backwards. Okay. So if you if I'm the interviewee and I start talking about washing poodles, you have to come up with why with, you were talking about washing with poodles. Yeah. Both an ant both a response to the thing I said before poodles. Okay. And as well as come up with a question that will lead to poodles. Okay. Do you can I can I be the interviewer? By all means. Okay. Okay, let me um Although I would like Drew, give us a. Oh, I already had something. Well. Okay, what do you? Let's hear what you got. Fuck. Let's hear what you got. Wait, I'm gonna give you just to make this more difficult. I'm gonna give you the starting topic, so you have to work back to it eventually. Okay. 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 Starting talk topic is fucking laser surgery to make your penis bigger. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. Or smaller. Okay, cool, cool. Cool. Now that's one poop stain that you're not getting off of that closet door. Back to you, Jim. <laughs> really? That's what you're gonna go with? <laughs> okay. And poop stain could be a metaphor. <laughs> <laughs> a metaphor for life. Okay. <laughs> uh, fuck. I, I just don't know. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? <laughs> There. That's my thing. What did you say? Just, I don't know. Like, what, what the fuck, dude? No, I'm kidding. I'm yeah. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Uh, uh, I, you know, and yeah, go and honestly, the, the medical oh, staff, sure right they were laughing at this incident so much <laughs> because the monkey, like, could not be stopped. And by the time it was over... I just, I just didn't want to look. So by the time you made it home, and your pet monkey was all over you, ravishing your newly shortened penis, um, was, is, I, did, they, they said, they said, the medical staff had contacted us telling us that they accidentally tore your rectum so bad that it, you were pooping uncontrollably. Can, do so, you have any comments on this? <laughs> So, yeah, like, not only are we working on uh, laser-enhancing surgery, we also have reduction surgery for those who are uh, too large uh, in stature, I guess, uh, would be the proper word. Or want to, yeah, just want to be and short. Why I, is this a thing? Is this cause and I myself am not only the inventor of this surgery, but I am also a, con a customer of the surgery because I had gone through the laser reduction uh, and... I'm so confused. Honestly, it was probably best for my monkey because he was starting... No! He was starting to bleed a lot from what I was doing. So the whole issue came up when you contacted your doctors telling them that... Or when you contacted your partners saying that you were making your monkey bleed by fucking him too hard. <laughs> How did this all end up leading to the poopy finale? <laughs> I 
Can you repeat the question? <laughs> I think we're done. No, no, no. We have to get back to the start. Okay. Um. <laughs> uh, what did I say? Oh, fucking no. That's why I'm asking you to repeat it. Um. I I'm fucking like. Nice. Thank you. I am nice. I I said something about oh oh fucking the monkey. You know and. Being, oh. you know, I started out being in a sexual relationship with my monkey. I started out as a gas pump attendee or attendant. Nice fucking shot. Sorry for the layman. I and I thought to myself, God, there's got to be a way where I can be with my monkey and spank my monkey. <laughs> <laughs> without making him bleed. Without making him bleed. But the doctors, they originally wouldn't do anything for me. You said it was a fool's dream. I said it could never happen. That's, that's it. Brandon Dorman from... I guess we're giving from, away... I from guess away from I guess we're giving away my last name, are we? Oh, you can bleep that if you want. Brandon... From bloody monkey fucker to one of the most renowned scientists on the planet. Join, join me here is Brandon as he tells us about how he surgically changed the size of his wiener and ended up pooping all over his closet door just so that he wouldn't hurt his monkey when he butt fucked him. Brandon, you have the floor. Tell me. What did you do for a living before this? Intro video montage of me in a doctor's and, suit. And, yeah. Hi, I'm Brandon. You know, there's a big problem out there today with penis size. Some maybe too small, some too large. Whatever your problem may be, I can fix it. I am the copyright owner of Brandon's laser penis reduction or enhancement. I don't know which to do yet. <laughs> <laughs> let I'll let you know. But here's my number. 555-6969-420. Five, 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 <laughs> yes! 420. Wait one second. No penis is too small or too large for me to handle. <laughs> and I want to make your dick dream come true. Says the reporter. <laughs> <laughs> that was like before she realized they were on air and she was like oh shit <laughs> roll the video alright you gotta finish it that was I mean no that was I just did the extra yeah but you're the interviewer we did the beginning yeah well oh yeah introduce that video that he just, he just yeah I, I figured just, I, just, I'm not saying that you, you completed it but just okay, I'll do the other reporter in, just introduce yeah. that yeah. yeah okay Jim was the name and now we'll we'll send you over to Lucy Laffer to to check out this scientist's new newest invention, which is sure to rock somebody's world. In the boudoir. I feel like I missed a lot of stuff. I also feel like I didn't give a before that. The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. <laughs> ba 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 ba. <laughs> New McDonald's buy one get one deal. You buy a burger, you get a burger. <laughs> Check it out. The nacho fries are back. <laughs> Ready to live moss? Oh, uh, those are the most annoying things on the planet. Ready to live moss? Got a high munchies? Joinks. Come to Taco Bell. For the fourth meal. <laughs> oh. There's more than one. There's... Dude. Oh, there's a lot of them. Yeah. Rip. That uh, that didn't work. Oh, they're really weak in their tail if you shoot them there. Yeah, not the face. Oh! Oh! Poor boy. The following has been rated. <laughs> wow. The following is rated PG-13 for sex, nudity, and fucking. <laughs> and monkey fucking. <laughs> rated T for teen. Rated Peggy 13. <laughs> Rated uh, T for the monkey gets fucked. <laughs> Rated E for everyone for gratuitous nudity. <laughs> 
It's okay though, it's breastfeeding. Rated P, please. Ah, God damn it! Rated P for please fucking stop. <laughs> please! Save us all! Rated E for- Ooh, a map! Rated E for everyone keeps making jokes about this. And it's annoying now. Rated T for time for this joke to die. Rated R for- Are you ready, kids? It's really hot oh, in this room someone. and we're all going crazy. Rated G cool. for God, why won't it end? Rated G for get out of here. <laughs> As he left. Dude, Vega. Vega? More like Vegan. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Oh my golly, I'm going crazy. Dude, me too. I'm like really uh, fucking behind, tired. Yeah. Oh, never We've mind. been going for a little while and I'm just kind of ready to yell. We're getting delirious, yo! Finished with my woman cause she couldn't help me suck my dick. What? People, ba -da -ba -da. people think I'm insane he, he because... He looks so cute right there. He's like, oh. the way he looks back, he's like, what are you doing, master? Oh. Nani? Yeah. Oh my. Nani? Nani? Ska? Nandeska? Nandeska? Nani? Slice it. Oh shit, ow. His eyeballs. Nice poke, though. Um. Oh, uh, what the fuck? Favorite Ben Stiller movie? Go. Uh, Tropic mm. Thunder. Tropic Sorry. Thunder. Maybe Zoolander. Oh, Zoolander, maybe. That's a good one. Along came Polly. I still haven't seen that one. You're not missing much. Yeah, I don't. I, don't, I believe that. Wait, along came Paul. I thought you said that was a. Yep. Uh, it's Ben Stiller. Oh, you're right. For some reason, I thought it was Adam Sandler. No. Because someone was talking about Adam Sandler in a, like a really serious movie, and it sounded really. Uh, stupid. funny people. No, funny people was actually funny. It wasn't a. The scene with Eminem was fucking crazy. Oh my god, I forgot about that. <laughs> I mean, it's a comedy. The fuck are you looking at, dude? It's a comedy, but it's also like very, very serious. Yeah, it's more serious. Funny people? Yeah. Yeah. Very weird for the Seth name. Rogen and Adam Sandler. Huh. It's like the point of it is like It's about comedians. And how horrible their fucking lives are. Oh, and okay. how cancer's a bitch. I've never even heard yeah. of it. Being a comedian with cancer? That sucks. It's worse than being a normal person with cancer. Because <laughs> like people expect you to still be funny about it. Yeah, because depression. Yeah, they expect dude. you to make jokes about your cancer. Did I just Oh, I just forced to deal with it in an unhealthy and different way. <laughs> you can't Very get if, if you get your cancer treated, you're no longer funny. Yeah. That's Honestly, sad. yeah. S sad boys. If I anything hurt. good happens to you in your life, you're just not a good comedian. I really hurt right now. Yeah. Unless you have a son or a daughter, then everybody. Dude, he hit the barrel class. away from you. What a dick. What a nice guy. I'm shooting this guy in the dick. Never shoot a man in the dick. I'm call me Butters. I just shot him in the dick three times. Four times. What are you doing? I'm shooting him in the dick. Dude, he's Stop just it. hanging out there. Oh, that's good. Oh! Oh, I forgot. I have the thing where I glory kill from farther away. I should probably try that. Let me glory kill you, you fuck! Jesus Christ! God. Damn. You just fucking slammed him, Paula. You just slammed him right in his booty butt. I'm just skipping through so much shit now. Just going from point A to point B. I'm I think so you tired. have to kill everyone. I'm so fucking tired. Tired? I'm tired. Dude, same. Like, the heat is getting to me. The monster didn't do shit. Like, it, it was just like... Do you ever this feel... This fan feels like it's not even working. I mean, you know... You know that point in tiredness where you're just kind of like... I miss Curious. where you're like I miss the 1960s. No. Back when MLK was alive. Dude, I miss that. And it's like Yeah, I wish I was old enough. To dude, MLK was alive and bean burritos were like 50 cents. Yeah. Like times were good dude, and milkshake you're milkshake without spending 5 bucks. You also got paid like $3 an hour. And then you sleep and then you wake up nice and refreshed and you're like, yeah, the 1960s weren't that great. What with the racism and all. 
even though we Truth. still fucking have it, but I'm not going to get political here. Uh, my point is that well, bean burritos just, are kind of really good. I don't think it's political to say racism, this is, racism is bad. No, I'm not going to get into a political statement about the current state of the country. Oh, sure. Uh, my number one problem, honestly... Is that bean burritos are too expensive now. Is that... I don't understand why racism is a thing. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I just don't get it. It doesn't well, make it's, sense. It's because we feel that because our skin pigment is different, that we are genetically superior, even though it's a matter of where the fuck we were born. Well, racism is definitely not just, like, whites versus everyone else, you know? No, 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 no. But I just don't I, understand why anyone sees each I other didn't mean. Different. I didn't say whites. I meant, like, just racism what? is... Genetically superior is mainly, like... A white stereotype for racism. Which it shouldn't be because that's just a general racism thing. Like, if you think that you are better than a certain race or ethnicity because of your ethnicity, that's racism. Like, you could. I, I didn't want to get political, God damn it. I don't. Yeah, I, like, I get why racism, like, what it is, I just don't understand why. Well, I don't understand why it's, like, why white is, I, I don't know, I've, I've seen, mind. yeah, I've, I've seen people be just racist in general, and it sucks. Speaking of racism, no, I'm kidding. Ah, uh, yeah. just, I think we're all equal, except these people. <laughs> like, honestly, except for those white people. Yeah, fuck them. Right? Like, World War II? Is there anything down Dude, here that looks good? Same. Not yet. Okay, we're just gonna go. Uh, World War II, same. Uh, knowledge is power. Uh, knowing is half the battle. Power is knowledge. Go get him, get him, get him before he gets away. He's not gonna run away. He, he actually is. Wait, what? Oh no, he's going out there. I say like, you can't get him when he's flying. He won't let you. He just threw that at me. I hate you. What a dick. What are you doing, Brandon? Uh, yawning. Some very annoying yawn. Don't yawn. Wow, I can't help it. Don't make fun of my fucking condition. Don't yawn. What's your what condition? What is that thing go back Cl there? What the fuck? Sy <laughs> Sy syphilis. I have. Oh, I have that condition too. Got it from a prostitute in Bangkok. Don't we all? You gave it to me. Yeah, so? <laughs> so I knew you had it. I mean the audience. Though. I have, I have SIDS, CYDS, chronic yawning dick syndrome. That was I haven't a seen dick? one of these in so long. Yeah, it's been a while. It's because I've been in hell. It's been a hard. while since I fucked Same. anything. Wow. People don't that like me. That ended up being me. really, re uh, really relatable. Yeah. Not for you. Yeah. But it's been a while. <laughs> I think we have different definitions of while, Ashton. Um, <laughs> when we come back. Yeah. Wait, I want to see if I live this situation. Oh yeah, you live. You made it. No, he didn't. You're, you're, but he, he just did. Oh, he's about to get more health. Oh my God! Nice switch. Dude, oh my God. You're fucking him. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful! Fucking. Fuck him in the button. Oh, baby. Touch his button. Oh! Oh! No! Oh, oh dude. You lucky duck. Oh, my God. Oh! <laughs> oh, my oh, no, God. It's a big Satan. That's not good. <laughs> Satan! Holy fuck! Oh my god. You should go poke him. Oh my god. How? You have five health. Five? Oh my god. I mean, not anymore. Okay. Okay, back in the game. Dude, checkpoint. Alright, when we come back. When we come back, we'll suck on some titties. Oh, I... Which titty do you want to suck on? No! no yes! No, not no, this again! Not. To the right! I'm so tired. Oh, Same. we did it. I lost I all can't I lived. I lived that situation. We That's fucking crazy. did it. I lived through that. Okay. I want to like, make sure it's safe. Like, get to something concrete. What the fuck is